Welcome back. Today we're going to do something different again and open up some Dragon Ball Super Booster Packs. I don't know too much about these cards or the card game, but I'm a big fan of the anime. So let's see if we could find some really cool looking and unique cards from these packs. Really do enjoy changing it up and opening up some different uh, booster packs or different cards. Um, I mean, I obviously enjoy Pokemon, but it's nice to change it up a bit. Um, yeah, I don't know anything about these packs. Gosh, it's actually kind of difficult to open. Yeah, I don't know too much about these cards. Um, I obviously know plenty about the anime, but I got a decent amount of these cards, and I don't know, they look really unique. So, we'll see how this goes. So, launch the wild one. Kaioken Sun Goku, a heavy toll. Katopsi Sonic Justice. Homicidal Clones. Launch ins Inspiring Support. I think these cards are all like moments in the anime. So I don't know how you, you play them. 8 or 8. Vados Assistance, Piccolo, Nemit, Piccolo, Nemikin Fortification, Kaba's Awakening, Sabaman Infinite Assault. I think this is, I guess, the equivalent of a Reverse Hollow in Pokemon. And in the back we have Vegeta the Third, Lineage's Beginning. Hmm. These cards are very interesting. Like I said, I have no clue how to play the game, but it's really unique for sure. Um, I think these are kind of similar to Digimon. Let's see, Yamcha's Wolf Fang Pitching Fistball. Interesting. Rome Brash Supremacy. Android 16 for his mother. I didn't know he had a mother. Goku Solar Flare. Well, I'm obviously looking for a Goku card. Um, Katopsia Modular Mastery. Android 13, The Unstoppable. It's a really cool looking card. Zabaruto Heroic Stance. Desperate Measures. Dream the Future. Universe 9, Striker. Aragano, Mercenary Tao, Overflowing Confidence. This guy is a really unique character in the anime. In the back, Trio de Dangers, Fierce Trinity. Hmm, that's interesting. I also don't know the rarities of these cards as well, so I don't know if I got anything really good or not, but I guess I'll find out later. But yeah, if you've never seen the anime, I would highly, highly recommend uh, the show or the anime. I mean, it's been out for so long and I think they're still making new episodes. Intensifying Power Trunks. Riverine, the power of support. Android 13, the unstoppable. Ooh, Golden Frieza, the perish. If you don't know, this guy is one of the big bad guys in the show. Toa, the next move. There's some of these I don't really recognize. Adoptive Father, Son Gohan. Desperate Measures. Universe 9, Supreme Kai Ro. Frieza's Call. Newfound Power, Son Gohan. Wow, that's a pretty cool looking card. Bardock's Father and Son. That's very interesting will say I think Bandai um, these Dragon Ball Z cards and I think they do Digimon as well the cards look I think they look a lot better than Pokemon cards they obviously make them a little differently but I really like the artwork Super Saiyan Bardock never ending vengeance universe 4 assemble super 17 energy absorber and her yeah super 17 android 16 for his mother 
Android 14, the, min the mission begins. Tin Shinhan, mysterious technique. Unexpected casualties, of course it's Yamcha. Trunks, bridge to the future. Sarban, the Emperor's attendant. Android 14, Stotic Fist. Bonds of Friendship, Android 8. Gene, Heroic Support. Hmm. Alright, well, I'm on the last booster pack. I don't really know what to expect from these booster packs, but I mean, it's real cool. It's, it's pretty unique. Um, like I said, some of these characters I don't really recognize. Dawn of Terror, Android 13. Reverend, Pretty Cannon Unleashed. Your Worst Nightmare. Bulma, Inspiring Support. Tora, Keeper of the Red Arm Armband. Mecha Frieza, Full of Soul. There we go, that's a really cool looking card. Flying Nimbus. It's a young Goku. Trunks, Time Regulator. Sabamin, Endless Explosions. Universe 9, Striker, Aragano. Adoptive Father, Son Gohan. And the last card is King Vegeta, the subordinate. Hmm. So these are the hollow foil cards that we found in the booster packs. Again, I don't know the rarity of these cards, but they're definitely cool and unique looking. These cards are a little different looking compared to what I'm used to seeing for Pokemon cards. It was nice to change it up a bit and open up some different booster packs than what I typically open up. So hopefully I'll do more of these in the future. Um, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and press that like button and go and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon to be notified when I upload a new video. Thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.